you glad he's alive? That was a crazy accident. Oh, no, it wasn't made against the truck. Hey guys, welcome to Family Fun Pack. We're in the car heading out on a road trip, but it's not for the best of reasons. We are attending a funeral. Matt's grandma passed away, so we're gonna go to her funeral. She was 96, so she did live a really good long life, but of course it's still sad when someone you love passes away and they're not here anymore. You guys remember when I lost my grandma? So, um, her husband's still alive, so we still have Matt's grandpa, and we actually have his other grandpa still here. So we have two grandpas left, which we're really thankful for. But anyway, we're taking you guys along with us on the road to Utah. We're going to be heading to Salt Lake City. We just left my mom's house. We have Heather with us. My mom even gave us snack bags for the kids, so it is going to be a good road trip. Seven Magic Mountains right out there. We visited that before on our channel. You guys might remember it. So let's like that one and the one on the very edge over there, the rainbow. Wow, this is way bigger than it looks like from the freeway. Look at you. Oh. Oh. <laughs> well, we stopped at our favorite place, Iceberg, to get shakes. Chloe's happy to be out of the car. Oh, yummy. <laughs> we got Nutella. Oh, yum. We just left Iceberg. We're full. It was so good. But I have to tell you, we were able to talk to the owner again. And it's like we're BFFs already, even though we've only met a couple times. When we talked last time, we had a heart to heart. So we bonded. But anyway, she sent me home with milk. <laughs> like, how nice is that? We were asking if there was any place to know of those 24 hours. And there's nothing here open late at all. And she's like, you know what, I have milk. I'll just replace it tomorrow, I'll just take my milk. And so she just gave us a gallon of milk for Chloe. So nice. Yeah. Chloe wants it already. It's raining. Oh, oh gosh. Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh. Thank you, Owen, what a helper. That rain just started fast. We all fit in the elevator. So we made it to our hotel. We're just discussing bedding arrangements. Looks like Matt and I are gonna be in here with Chloe and a couple people and Heather's gonna be in the other room. Owen's gonna be with us. And of course, we're also trying to make sure the air conditioner works because even though it's the winter, it's kind of hot and we don't want to sweat. See you guys in the morning. It is the next morning and we're trying to pack. Heather and Matt are working on that. And the weather out there is, you know, Okay, and in case anyone noticed that and they're wondering what's going on, we are delivering that to my sister. So, yeah, <laughs> being helpful. We're heading into the grocery store to get some food. It is literally so cold. Every time I come to Utah, I forget how actual cold it is here. We are not getting chemical cookies. Yeah, it's so good. No. <laughs> We're gonna find something. We're eating healthy, that's why. <laughs> Oh, okay. Whoa. I know I just said we're eating healthy, but that looks really good. It's snowing out there. Look at that. It is so cool, isn't it? I know, I'm already getting flashbacks of being unprepared for the cold. for gas in the cold. Now we're gonna run into this gas station. Come on, I want to hold my hand. Oh yeah, he's keeping his hands warm. Don't hold my hand, that's smart. I'll hold his arm. Freezing cold. I was gonna let Christine drive, but I don't know. Look at all the ice. Are you good in the snow? I'm a good driver in the snow. Hurry, open the car, I'm cold. No, wait, raise your hand and think your mom should drive. Yes. <laughs> You're really gonna drive? All right. Can't believe I'm letting Christine drive. The middle class is a whole way to Saint George. As soon as Christine started driving, it fell in the gutter. I'm a good driver. I've never been in an accident ever. So there's that. I just remember before we were married, we were driving in Nevada or somewhere on the freeway, and she was getting so close to the. Uh, 
like cement pillar. I no, thought I was going to die. Doing anything. <laughs> this close. It's, I was driving poorly at that time. I guess I should count my lucky stars Matt that I'm getting alive. Scared and it was like making me For a reason. We're heading to dinner right now, but we had to stop and show you guys one of our favorite places to see in Utah. And look, it's right behind me. It's the Up House. It's so cute. And there's a house two doors down that is also equally as cute. I'm gonna show you guys both of them. Well, here we are outside freezing at the Up House. It's snowing. And it's snowing. This is like my dream house. <laughs> Right? It's absolutely beautiful. We do love it. Why don't we go to the up house? We just got in the car from taking pictures and Owen literally said, when are we gonna be to the up house? I was like, wait, what did you say? I think he thinks it's a restaurant. It's okay. The up house is actually this cute house that we're sitting right outside of. It's called the up house. Okay, he agrees. This is the other house I was telling you guys about. It's so cute. Love that house. Well, we are at this cute restaurant that our friend found. We're meeting them there, but we also have our milk with us. So we're gonna hide our milk outside. No, it's gonna like over there. We're hiding our milk because we want it to stay cold. <laughs> and there's our friends right there. <laughs> I don't even really know what it is inside your restaurant. Yeah, it's a restaurant that doesn't really look like a restaurant. That's why it's so cool. Look up. Hi guys. Oh, this is so cool. Wow, this is so cool, Victoria. This is so awesome. You're like literally under cars. So cool, right? Our silverware is wrapped in a shop towel. There's a McLaren? Oh, wow. Isn't this cool? Yes. Oh my gosh. This is so neat. You like the McLaren? Yeah. This is really cool. Oh, is that a Lamborghini over there? The orange one? Look at all these boys. There's so many boys. And one girl down there. Luckily we have you, Heather, to be an extra girl. And Chloe. Good you guys, it's like legit snowing. Owen, are you enjoying the snow? Yeah. This is crazy. It's like really cold. Okay, we're gonna check out our milk. Our milk is still there. There's some snow on it, but it looks like it was uh, kept nice and cold. Yeah, to keep it cold. <laughs> you like the snow, sweetie? Yeah. You're just covered. Hurry, everyone, hurry. We're heading into our next spot. That's where we're right there because they don't have that in California. We're trying on some jackets here. It's a serious problem. Hey, I mean, yeah. I'm too tall for everything. That's like true, it is a little short. I mean, it's a good color at least. <laughs> Okay, we're leaving and you might notice I'm in a new outfit. Well, I'm in a new jacket. It's so cold, my lips are cold. But I'm hoping it keeps me warm because we are dressed way too California. They're all deciding who's gonna drive with who because everybody wants to ride with Victoria. I guess we're not cool anymore when there's step in aunties. She's like a best friend, but you know, Jessica and Victoria, we consider them ants for our kids. So, oh gosh. This is like a lot of snow, you guys. Oh, I got some in my mouth. This is fun, though. No. It's fun to see snow like once a year, but you know, we see snow like three times this year, and that's too much. So, we're good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> There's so much snow. <laughs> this is so cool. Look, it's on our car. It's everywhere. This is like actually a lot of snow. Yeah, this is like actually a lot. Oh my gosh, my teeth are cold. This is so cool though. Like I have to say I've not experienced like snow like this where it's just like on your stuff. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. Matt just said he's gonna make a snowball. Whoa, I'm just to throw at me. <laughs> he got it off the windshield. 
we are at this cute little place where you can ride scooters to the ramp. Nice. You can also skate. Okay, let's see you go, Michael. Good job, Michael. Owen. We're looking everywhere. We're looking for Owen. They're calling his name. Can I go in there? Yeah, go look for him. Okay, well, we found Owen's shoes. He's gotta be here. We found Owen. Thank goodness. Now he's in the fun area. have no room even though we already checked in because their system is like down I guess the internet's not working so we went to our room that we already checked into and there was someone in there so now we are uh, sitting in the, lobby. in the lobby Matt's trying to find us another hotel yeah. and there's other people also waiting with their stuff on the ground because apparently everyone's going to be getting given away I know we're like we already knew our room numbers and it's midnight <laughs> okay we got into a room they upgraded us a little bit so that's good we have instead of being like in multiple different rooms we have a room here and then we have like a little living room and then the master over there so it's actually better to be all in one room so I guess it was kind of fortunate I guess that they gave away our rooms <laughs> um, we have no room key, there's like no internet. So, there's that. But I mean like we're in a room and that's, that's good, we're thankful. I mean a bed is a bed. That's right. Can you wrap your Rubik's Cube in that, huh? Yeah, it's nice to that. <laughs> I can't get ripped. Hey, this is nice though. Actually, look at this nice kitchen, Matt. Cute little table. And then this is our room over here. Hey, there's a nice bathroom. Wow, it's big. It's the next morning, it's nice and cold of course, and we are heading out to Grandma's funeral. Chrissy looks so handsome.
we just arrived at the cemetery. We're gonna dedicate the grave and say goodbye to Grandma. You found some snow? Yeah, you did. We're doing whatever we can to stay warm. I'm really cold. Like, my fingers are numb. Shh, be really quiet. I know it's really cold. We're heading back to the car. We're gonna get some lunch. Did you enjoy the funeral? Yeah. It was a nice service, wasn't it? I was going to share something that stood out for me at the funeral service and it's that in one of the talks about her, she said to her daughters that having a family was the most important thing she did in her entire life. I was thinking, that's exactly how I feel. My grandparents have 24 grandkids and 78 great-grandchildren. And they have like four great-great-grandkids, I think, too. It's a pretty big family. One at a time. Good girl. <laughs> so cute. I told the kids they could help stack chairs only if they wanted to. Owen is over here by himself stacking chairs because he's a really good helper. Good job, Owen. These are tricky chairs and they're heavy too. They are very heavy. Now Michael joined in helping. They've got a pretty good stack of chairs over there. Cleaning everything up still. We're back at the hotel. We're changing into something a little more comfortable because, you know, it's cold and none of us want to wear church clothes any longer than we have to. We're probably going to go out, maybe see my sister and do something fun. And then we're going to have a family dinner tonight. And then tomorrow we head back home. Everyone's just relaxing. Yeah. Did you have a good day today? Yeah. For the most part, yeah. I'm filming this way so you guys can see the gorgeous sky behind me. But anyway, my sister, I guess, can't meet us. So instead, we're going to a thrift store because they kind of have like cool thrift stores in Utah. This is the store. It is not Goodwill, but it's similar. I'm leaving with a bag of stuff. Not for myself. I'll show you guys in just a second. So you guys get some good finds? We did. Would you like to see what I got you? Yeah. Wait. Okay, okay. Well, the first thing I got, this one's more for Michael. I got this Adidas sweatshirt, or jacket. It's cool, right? Okay, I'm gonna show you everything I got and I'm gonna say the price. And this is all from a thrift store? Yes. All used. This is Under Armour. This one is for you, so you won't be cold tomorrow because I know you're gonna be cold. I got this like church shirt for Zach and Chris because they don't really have that much church clothes and this is like really nice. It felt like it was brand new because I was telling Heather there's one David and two twins. So sometimes I only got one thing for David and sometimes I got two things for David. So he passed down two items, but sometimes we'll have just one. So Zach and Chris are a little bit lacking. Look at this. Whoa, that's so I cool. thought you would like that. Look at this. I found that one. Isn't that cool? And the arm looks like, cool. this shirt looks brand new. Doesn't look like anyone's ever worn it, so. That was a good find. This is also brand new that one too. with the tags. It's like a little dress. I thought it was really cute. These are obviously for Chloe to grow into, but look how cute. This cute dress. And then this cute dress. Now, the grand total of all of this. Look how cute. All this stuff, $31. Not bad. It's definitely better than $131. Mm -hmm. I thought it was. it was a good deal. I mean, that's a lot of stuff and nice stuff for that price. Especially the dresses. Those are, These cute. are cute, right? All of the kids are sitting with Grandma. Oh, your first buffet. I'm just going to pull. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Hopefully she doesn't I know. I'm going to have plastic plates. That's okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> she is. But the four essential food groups. Now all of my kids, every one of them, is right here with Grandma. Okay, I've got one. Getting food with her. <laughs> Grandma's not gonna have a single second alone. Are you looking at the desserts? Yeah. What are you wanting? I want mint ice cream and a uh, cone. Can I come? Okay, I'll help you with it. These are the bottom. Okay. So this goes on the bottom, right? Yeah, and then we get the ice cream. Okay, you hold it right there. A fun part. And this is the way to put the ice cream down, just like that. Okay, hold it down. It comes out kind of slow. Oh, it's coming out faster. Good. Is that enough? Yes. Okay. We need a plate. What a helper you are, Owen. Thank you for cleaning. Right now, I'm cleaning the tables, the chairs, and the cushions. You're doing a great job. Even the cushions? Yeah. Oh. What a helper. Good to see you guys. You're welcome. Bye, bro. Okay. Bye. 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 Yeah, she does. My sister made cookies, of course, spoiling us. Meanwhile, Chloe's just standing there. Raw is good. Tell us in the comments, raw or burnt? Let's see the cookie. Let's see. Oh, those are perfect. <laughs> you guys are weird. What's going on here? Michael, he's just letting you. Alex, you're weird. Chloe keeps trying to walk. There's a back massage chain and I'm not in it. What in the world? I'm kind of jealous. Matt, how was your nap? Great. How'd you wake up? The most exciting part was on the power. Yeah, I already jumped in bed with you. That wasn't awkward at all. Alex, not in me. Just a little cuddly. What the? Here's what we woke up to today. Oh, it's so soft. Oh. It's coming in the room. <laughs> Look, it's snowing in our Catch room. Catch some. Oh, it's slowed down a lot. We're off. That's a heavy cart. Yeah. 
Wow, it definitely snowed. Oh my gosh, it's so bright I can't see. The snow is like powdery soft. Is there a lot in the car? Wow, look at that. That's something we don't see very often. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have sunglasses on and I still feel like I can't see it it's so bright in the snow. Well, one thing is living in the snow would make excellent lighting for filming. That's true. It's crazy how it was completely white skies a few minutes ago and now it's like blue skies after it's done snowing. Everybody wants to clean some snow off the car. We are enjoying snow for a moment before we leave. And I made this rubber snowball because it feels like rubber. Look, I could really poke it and nothing breaks. It just feels like Crazy, rubber. Crazy, huh? Yeah, and it's not that cold either. Yeah. And we have our hot cocoa sitting in the snow, of course, because it's very hot. We made it. We're driving. And just like that, we're back into really bad weather. It's snowing pretty hard. Are you guys okay? I hear people up there. This is like, you're walking around, you're like, this is like my second accident, right? Hey, be glad he's alive. That was a crazy accident. I don't know what made me lose control. The cops are finally here. Oh wait, I think that's a fire truck. Looks like they finally got here. I'm gonna flag them down because I'm the only one down here. Everyone else is up with the guy and his car, so I'll flag them down. We were almost home and we witnessed a crazy accident. I was, I guess the only one really looking and I watched this guy lose control as he tried to make an exit video was missing. And his car literally rolled over the edge of the freeway down a steep embankment and just started rolling over and like disappeared. It was crazy. I called 911, I was the first caller. And then we turned around, we quickly looked for a landmark. Matt saw like a hotel, quickly saw it. He like just turned around, got off the freeway and tried to find this hotel and tried to find the guy. We were there at least five minutes before even the first responders came there here and now. We went up and got the guy. Surprisingly, he didn't have any injuries like that we could see. Like he was like talking and okay and happy to see us. But I mean, oh my gosh, crazy. I feel like, like this is like an everyday occurrence. Like he seems so chill. Yeah, he like, was oh, really I'm calm. Fine. Yeah, he's I'm like, you this. could be more injured than he's like, oh no, someone told me a story like that once, but I'm fine. I'm like, yeah. okay. We talked to his wife on speakerphone on FaceTime and <laughs> It's got this big yeah. truck up there. It's balanced between two you trees. See this, like, on a yeah. Yeah. If the, like, yeah. it if the, the right trees weren't there, he would be he would still If be like he did not go in the, the trees, he would have kept rolling down the hill. He's yeah. like super lucky. He would have rolled down the whole hill. Yeah. He had completely slipped. Crazy. And the firemen were like looking at my kids and they go, where's your seatbelt? Who's in the car? We're like, not. Yeah, we weren't in the car, but they reminded us, stay in your seatbelts because that's what saved this guy's life most likely. Oh, we made it home. Oh, hello, Hana. Oh, Hana's really excited. Where are you, Mally? Oh, there he is. There you are. <laughs> Did you guys miss us? Hi, Hana. Hello. <laughs> okay everybody we made it home what a whirlwind we went all the way from southern california to salt lake city which is northern utah between thursday and sunday and it's sunday night right now it's about midnight so we did get home late um but that's pretty crazy right gosh i'm like still processing the accident we just saw i'm glad we we're there to help that guy even though he wasn't injured badly which i'm also really glad about but Anyway, it's much warmer in California than Utah. Also thankful for that. Um, we'll see you guys in our next vlog. Bye. Mm -hmm.